Hi, my name's Kieran Connolly. I'm the founder and head coach of Sports Fun for All. So today you're at the Bellingham Leisure Centre to see our football project. We deliver free football every Friday and Wednesday from 5 to 7 p.m. for young people aged 15 to 19 years old. What young people gain from coming here is it's a free space where they can come, make friends, socialise, be in a safe environment. They're looked after by qualified football coaches with DBS check, who have lots of experience of working with young people and can provide mentoring support to them. My name's PC Darren Smith. Yeah, I'm PC Dan Sullivan. Uh, we're from the youth engagement team um, in the Met Police. Our roles are primarily to um, engage with the young community, um, also to offer diversionary options uh, for young people who are referred to us, um, and to obviously be a point of contact for a lot of youth organisations, including schools and colleges as well. Yeah, we all think it's excellent, don't we? And um, yeah, brilliant. Right. You know, um, like I've been a uniform response officer for a long time and I never knew that um, places like this existed and um, and it's absolutely fantastic because it gives an opportunity for young people on a Friday night to be somewhere safe to play football it's well coached it's well run here and not only is it they play football here you've got um, you know um, like education talks we also come down as well and it's just a nice safe place on a Friday night for young people to come down play Absolutely. football safely you know it's a you know like it's a win-win situation I mean quite often don't we you know you see police officers turning up because something has happened whereas in my well like in our opinion if we could prevent yeah. stuff from happening and a lot of stuff can be prevented is by young people not hanging around by going to constructive places like this place here Absolutely. You know. Jan Brown and I work for Phoenix Community Housing. Uh, part of my role is managing our uh, community chess fund which is £100,000 and I'm here today to talk about uh, the work that uh, Kieran and Sports Fund for All um, have done as uh, one of our community chess projects. The Phoenix ethos is uh, working together with our community to develop a better community and, uh, and really this project absolutely feeds into that because we're providing, of Sports Fund for All uh, with our funding are actually providing free football provision for young people. Um, it's really important. Kieran and, and Sports Fund for All have, uh, this is their, now they're in their third year of funding. Um, and our tenants actually have to vote for the projects that they want to see funded. And the fact that this is the third year now that the tenants have actually uh, voted for this project to, to be funded um, shows that the local people actually feel that there's a real benefit um, in providing uh, this, this fantastic project to them. Storm. My name's Craig, I'm from the Lewisham Youth Offending Service and I'm an Advanced Youth Offending Officer for um, Lewisham Council. Okay. Uh, my role works with young people. Uh, it's more about working with the young people that are on court orders or um, youth cautions. Um, and we kind of engage with the young people through taking them through uh, special interventions to change some of their offending behaviours. So more or less just uh, you know, building confidence and building a pro-social identity in the community. And Sports Funds for All allows, allowed uh, a number of youth offenders, uh, young offenders, to work with Sports Funds for All and support young people playing football. So it's a space which allows young people to give back to the community, which is more establishments and um, schemes is what's needed. My name is Jaden, I'm from Downham and I come to both sessions um, on a Wednesday and Friday. Uh, my name's Tegan, I'm from Bellingham and I go to both sessions on Wednesday and Friday, 5 to 7. I attended when it first got introduced, really, and then I took a, a little break because I kind of fell out with like football and that, plus I had a serious injury. But then I came back um, of recent um, when I found out a few of my friends worked here as well. And I think it's a, a good opportunity for um, kids to come off the streets as well and do something productive for like two hours a week basically. So yeah, I used to come here a time ago, like six years ago, 
and I really stopped because I didn't really like have a passion for football. But now I started coming back, and I feel like this is really like I should say a good influence for younger people to come off the streets and play football and just have a good time.